I want to say to you, happy Valentine's Day. I pray that you'll be my Valentine. I certainly send you my greetings of love. I certainly have love welling up inside of me for you. Uh, many of you I hear from, and uh, I feel a close relationship with many of you, even though we've never met. I want to talk about Valentine's Day. I also want to talk about love for a moment. One of the things that I say in my relationship seminar is people don't fall in love with you. They fall in love with the way they feel when they're with you. See, it's inside of them. It's what they feel when they're with you. For those that are going out on a first date, or maybe it's the 10th date today on Valentine's Day, I ask you to think about the way you're making the other person feel. You know what most people do on first dates. They talk about the bad experiences that they've had in the past how miserable he was, and how awful she was. And they dump this on the other person. Well, many times that person has to crawl their way out of, uh, of the room. They, they desire inside of themselves just to get away. Now, you're a positive person, so instead of broadcasting from your mouth and your actions, negativity, broadcast positivity. It is the best way in the world to break the ice. And even if you're with someone that you've been with 10,000 times, why not, for Valentine's Day, make this person feel wonderful by being with you? You can do this with one person, or you can do it with a group. People will love you for the way they feel when they're with you. Remember the old TV show, Cheers, where the theme song said, Everybody Knows Your Name? Well, that is a deep desire of all of us. We want to be in a place where people know our name or our nature, and we also want to be in a place where we are wanted. Well, what makes us wanted? Well, the way that we make other people feel. What we bring to the table when we bring ourselves into the room. When you come into a room this Valentine's Day, I pray that you're going to make the whole room just galvanized with your spirit of love and acceptance. That you'll be upbeat. That you'll make other people feel wonderful. And you'll find a great truth that you'll also have 10 times, maybe more, of a better time than you would have had by the difference of the level of your broadcasting. You're going to broadcast out uh, an attitude that is just something that, that other people want to soak in like a sponge. Well, that's my prayer for you and a little bit of our relationship seminar. If you want to come to one of these, we're going to be holding one in Cleveland, Ohio in April, uh, and uh, I invite you to come if you're near that area. Happy Valentine's Day, my friend, and again, I send you my love on this great day of love.